I have this heart that says love in the center, and I got this from Joanne Fabrics online with a 40% off coupon. It was originally $8.99, and I'm going to take my Wise Owl Snow Owl and paint the entire heart. And I'm focusing more on the raised areas. Now I have my clear casting resin. Now if you never worked with resin, there's two parts. You have a part A and a part B. And you have to mix equal parts in order for it to dry properly. So I like to use these red Solo cups and I cut them down. And I just poured my part A and I just mark with a Sharpie where that hit on the cup and I pour it into a bigger cup. And then I'm taking part B and I'm going to pour it up to that same line and then I'm going to mix that in with part A. And now I'm going to slowly stir this. The video is going to make it look like I'm doing this fast, but you don't want to create too many air bubbles, so you want to stir it slowly. For however long your directions say, as every resin is a little different. I'm then going to take my Republic Red Wise Owl paint and put a small amount into the resin we just mixed together. And I'm just using a popsicle stick to stir everything. And starting on the top row here, as you can see, it has an inlay of stripes. And I'm going to start on the top and just pour some of the Republic Red resin in there. And you don't want to put too much because you don't want it to overflow. And I just use a popsicle stick to kind of move it around. Now the resin is self-leveling, so as long as you're on a flat surface, it will level out. And again, you just want to pour enough so that it lays in the inlay and does not overflow. So I just do a little bit at a time and just you can move it around with your popsicle stick. And I just have a baby wipe just in case I get anything that spills over or if the resin goes across to my um, project, I can just wipe it up quickly. And sometimes I like to just lift up the heart and just tilt it around to try to get it to lay in all the cracks. And I did that every other section. And I'm just taking my heat gun very quickly, and this will help eliminate bubbles. Now, I remixed another batch of resin, and I mixed some Wise Owl black paint in this batch. And now I'm going to fill the other inlays with the black Wise Owl paint in resin. And I'm going to repeat the same steps as I did with the red, and I'm just going to go in the rest of the inlays and just pour the resin. Now remember, when you mix your epoxy in the beginning, please wear your gloves and you should also wear a mask through the entire time of working with the resin. Now this center section here, I'm just working on getting the epoxy to go underneath the word love so that it covers my entire inlay section. All right, so once I had everything filled in, I took my heat gun again and just quickly went over it. And you're gonna want this to dry for several hours. Once I allowed that to dry, I then came back with my metallic gold paint and I just pour a little bit on a paper plate and I have a very skinny art brush and I'm just going to paint over the word love in a gold. Now you can choose any colors you want to do this project. You can add glitter into the resin instead of paint, or they also have alcohol inks that also make the resin a really pretty color as well. So there are many options to do this so that it matches your home decor. Now Wise Owl has some really pretty metallic paints, this one is just a small one that I get right from Hobby Lobby, and it's the Deco Art brand. Now I have this ribbon that matched perfectly. I got it from Michaels, 
it's the black and white striped with the red glitter hearts and I'm just going to cut two pieces and crisscross them and then I had a gold ribbon that I just cut two smaller pieces and crisscross them on top and then I just take my jute and scrunch it together and then I just wrap the center of it with the gold ribbon as well and I'm just holding it together using some hot glue And now my gold ribbon was a little floppy, so I just took the hot glue and glued that down so it wasn't flopping all over. And I just glued that on the right upper part of the heart. And I'm just taking my Wise Owl Furniture Salve and my 2-inch palm brush, and I'm just applying a top coat of the salve. Now my jute hanger I cut off because I got a bunch of paint on it. Taping it down did not do the trick for me. So I just cut this ribbon I had that was black with some gold arrows, and I just glued that on the back to replace the jute. And there we go. Now we just have this fun love wall hanging, and this is another way that you guys can use the epoxy. I hope you enjoyed this video. Paint products can be found on our webpage at chocolateupfancy.com, and don't forget you can check out other tutorials on our webpage as well. Have a great day.